Hello everybody, welcome on back to the channel. Got a little something new today for you. I have been dying to try this freaking brand, Aloe Yoga. I know you've heard of them, have you? Mad people have been recommending and talking highly of this brand, so I've never tried them before, and as an active wear enthusiast, I mean, like, it's about time. We have a few sets here that we're gonna be talking about today. So I'm gonna be giving you guys my very first impressions of this brand, how the fit is, the feel, all that good stuff. Kinda let you know like, is it something worth looking into? But before we get into this video, definitely hit that subscribe button. It helps me out more than you know. You do not wanna miss our future videos. We got a ton more just like this coming up. So hit that subscribe button, tap that like button as well. Please and thank you. Now let's go get into it. I know you're looking at this sports bra. This is the sports bra we're gonna be talking about today. Doesn't it just smack you in the face? In fact, this beautiful bright color actually inspired Bay today. He raided my closet and you stole one of my scrunchies. You gotta come over here and let people see what you look like now. Show the world what my precious Bay look like. Okay, he stole my scrunchie. That's a direct match. Oh, we're that couple. Anyway, mad cringy, I know. So anyways, let's get into this first set. <laughs> Everything is in a size small. But I gotta tell you something. Aloe yoga's freaking expensive. Y'all didn't warn me about that when I went to go purchase this haul and uh, ow. I'll have everything linked down below so you can see for yourself. Warning. So first and foremost, we are looking at the No Limit Bra. Let me just tuck this up here. Listen, I don't know what I'm keeping yet, okay? So we're looking at the No Limit Bra with the ambiance shorts. Now these did not come as a set, sold as a set, anything like that. But what's cool is when you are viewing an item, like a lot of different websites, they'll show you like a matching color so you don't have to be sifting the site for something to match. I just wanna talk about this bright popsicle color that we have going on. It makes my fake tan look really extra tan. Okay, so it's working for me in that sense, but does it work for me in other areas? Good question. Well, the sports bra is very low support, right off the bat. It works for me, somebody who doesn't have like something to support really. <laughs> Bigger chested gals might want to look elsewhere, so the support on it is perfect just for me. You do have the adjustable straps. They're really thin straps. So again, big breasted women, it might weigh it down a little bit. I love the breakup of texture. That first and foremost is what I noticed is you have the really nice flat color in the front and then you have a nice breakup on the side here. Nice ribbed texture, so it breaks up the monotony a little bit. So overall, really flattering sports bra, and it kind of makes my gals look okay. Also, keep in mind, because this is like a yoga-based brand, a lot of the sports bras and some that you're gonna see today don't come with padding, but this one thankfully did. It actually comes with some bra inserts, they're removable. I like that, I'm just saying. Like sometimes I could go without the bra pad, but I'm limited. But these shorts, let me tell you something about these shorts. I could always use shorts for the summer. And my favorite kind of shorts are actually like looser fit with like the built in spanks underneath. I need that because I do some weird Overall, these shorts fit great. They're not like totally high waisted. Not a big deal. They're more like a mid rise. The only real downfall of these shorts is that the spanks underneath when really squatting around and moving, they do roll up. The overlying like looser fit on top is a very breathable, soft mesh, very gorgeous. And underneath, when you lift up the mesh, you see the big white aloe text. So I thought that was a nice touch, very cute. You also have a little baby pocket in there. So if you know you're running or something, then you can store something in there. When you wear these open, for me anyway, there's like a gape back there. So squatting, you're gonna see down your, to your underwear. I highly suggest you tie this up. Once it's tied, it's perfect. Untied, you might have some issues there. So overall, this set, winner. Definitely. Love the brights, perfect for summertime. Okay, so the next set I got, baby pink. Okay, we got baby spice vibes. I got the high-waisted aloe soft goddess legging and I paired it with the delight bralette. Straight up the delight bralette. Very cute, something I would wear underneath a tank. I don't know, girl. You don't have any bra pads in here, so this is something I, I don't even think I would wear to a yoga class. You know what I mean? <laughs> Maybe a loose yoga tank on top. I'm just mad insecure like that. I do not want my nips shining through. 
that would just embarrass the shiz out of me and I have to wear my hair down over it. You just have your normal spaghetti strap. It is adjustable, very secure fitting. It's a nice V neck type of sports bra. So it shows a little, a little something something, but it holds you in really nice. Again, very low support. So works for me, maybe not for others. The leggings are something of its own, let me tell you. This really stays true to its name when they call it aloe soft. It is one of the most soft leggings I've ever felt. This is perfect and ideal for yoga. And if you're looking to like work up a sweat, this one, because it traps heat. You can feel that type of material. So if you do some hot yoga and you want extra intensity, buy these leggings. <laughs> Damn, do I get a dreaded CT in these. It just rides right up in the front and it kind of kills the legging for me, dang. You have an overall marl design that turns into one big rib towards the bottom. And I actually really like them because it's like leg warmers, essentially. So I see what they were doing here. Definitely leg warmers on me. It goes like right up my foot. They're also super squat proof on me. So if I want to do like a downward dog, then I should be, uh, I should be all right. As nice as these leggings feel, I can't get past that camel toe. <laughs> <laughs> I really don't like front seams. I'm sorry, girl. If you do like front seams, that's awesome, but I just can't look past it. Okay, so I mixed it up and went with more of a neutral tone because I always gotta add that into the mix, duh. So uh, we got moto leggings, Hey, right? <laughs> Who am I right now? High waist moto legging, that's about it. <laughs> you see that front seam? Yeah, um, that rode up as well. <laughs> <laughs> but the overall look of this legging is freaking dope. If you don't feel like a badass wearing these, then you ain't wearing them right. I love the moto look. Basically, it's just essentially like a bunch of raised seams, <laughs> patches, if you will, kind of making you look like you're a motorcycle chick. I don't know if I would actually wear this that often, <laughs> now that I'm thinking about it. I wouldn't necessarily wear these to work out in, but for fashion purposes, with something long, like a long shirt up top, um, maybe? It is high waist, it's very thick. Thick, I'm just warning you. What's really cool is the breakup of the front. Like that's the statement on these leggings. And I actually really like that they put a little freaking patch like below your knee of straight see-through mesh on both sides. So you got on the back of your leg and you got on the front too. Feel a little wind get in there, that's the mesh. They're actually not totally squat proof. Is that weird? <laughs> that like out of all the bright colors that you see here, this is the one that was like 90%, 95% squat proof. I saw a little crack in there. So um, just want to mention that. Um, I thought that was a little weird because it's the darkest color, but whatever. A little bit long as well, right? I'm five foot three and they came a little bit long. Other than that, cute. To wear underneath something, yeah. But the camel toe. I actually got the matching top here. This is the lavish bra and you will feel lavish in it, just warning you. Actually, this doesn't even seem like a sports bra. When I put this on, I thought to myself, high-waisted jeans, wedges, out to dinner, all because of this band right here. That's what did it. It made me feel real sexy. I don't wanna waste this at the gym or doing yoga. I wanna wear this showing out, out to dinner eating lobster. So this sports bra right here right now is not adjustable, but look how, I told you this is sexy. Look at that backing right there. It is so, uh, you know, I really do love highway action sports bras. I really think they're sexy. This is actually one of their sports bras that have removable bra pads as well. So thank God. So with it being a mesh band, it doesn't have like crazy support, like say this one with the elastic in it. So a little less supportive, but I, I still feel super maintained in it. You know what I mean? Like I still feel secure. It's super low support, but it works. Like I said, it works and the quality is definitely there. So I know they do charge a lot, but I can feel the quality in these pieces. This is actually kind of shiny too. Like this bra in certain lighting has a little bit of that shine. So this is why it just reminds me of something other than working out. <laughs> but if you're somebody who wants to go work out, do some low key movements and you want to look real sexy, then get this one. Check this out. First of all, blue. <laughs> Something I don't normally go with, but um, once I show you this sports bra, you're gonna know why I did it. I'm a little risky lately. This is the Airlift Excite Bra. Excite Bra. 
and it's pretty exciting, I'm not gonna lie. This reminds me of when, oh man, in the early 2000s, when I used to go to uh, a roller rink, the trend was like the, the Tarzan look. This is bringing back mad memories and okay. <laughs> yeah, so you got the um, one shoulder strap. That's pretty freaking cute. You have an underlying mesh and then you have the actual sports bra over it. It's all connected, all sewn in together and uh, it's definitely very unique. You also have a nice one inch elastic band to keep you nice and tight, but there's no padding, no removable pads. So you're on your own with this one. You technically got like two layers. <laughs> So it's a little more, less nippy looking, but uh, keep that in mind though. I paired it with the 7 8 high waist airlift legging. So, so far everything's been really freaking long on me, all these leggings, but the 7 8 that's my thing. So if you're my size 5, 3 or under, look out for the 7 8 and you won't regret it. This baby is really soft, but it's got that total nylon feel. Let me look. Nope. <laughs> it's actually 84% polyester, 16% spandex. No, you feel like nylon. Um, so anyways, it's got that very slippery type of feel. That's why I thought it was nylon, but it's not. You also have a dreaded camel toe in this one as well. I don't know, comment down below if you tried aloe yoga and do you get a dreaded CT too or is it just me? Cause then I got some problems of my own to deal with. Overall, this is just a very opaque set. There is no texture, no breakup, no nothing. It's just one solid legging. So that's cool too, man. It's not every day you wanna make a statement. It is pretty squat proof on me. I didn't see any cheeks, so that's good. Overall, very, very comfortable. Extremely stretchy like everything you've seen here. Um, so if you're somebody who really loves stretch, I would probably say go with the pink ones, then the blue, then the moto. So this is, this is a nice happy medium. All these leggings are just a moderate support, like nothing high intensity or anything like that because well, it's meant for freaking yoga. <laughs> they all come equipped with a gusset. I didn't mention that, but the gusset isn't one of those long rainbow gussets. They're just a nice little patch. So it's still very flexible, four-way stretch, all that good stuff. Even though these have that slippery vibe and almost in some lighting a little bit of shine, a little bit, ever so slightly, they don't slide down though. They're, they're not that slippery kind of material, even though they kind of feel it. Um, so it's pretty good like that. It does hold up when squatting down or bending. So yeah, overall, really, really cute set. Blue, who knew? Just can't look past the camel toe. Alrighty guys, so that concludes my first impression slash almost like a mini review. I always get into it, man. I can't help it. <laughs> of aloe yoga. So comment down below, what are your thoughts? Is this something you would be interested in trying out? Me overall, like my final thoughts are their bras for me, you know, again, lower support bras are awesome. I think they're very flattering, super comfortable. Yes. The shorts, absolutely yes. They're awesome. The leggings though, I mean, they are very comfortable and cute. Just can't get past that camel toe, especially for the price. I ain't paying to have a camel toe, you know what I'm saying? So, I can see why they are popular, definitely. They're very comfortable and high quality, so I'll definitely give them that. I'm glad I got to try them out though for you guys, and uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you also found it helpful. Again, if you are not already, definitely hit that subscribe button. Help your girl out a little bit, appreciate it. I love you all so much, and I will definitely catch you in my next video.